Welcome, in front of me is a Qbar X30 and today I'll show you how to go through the setup process of the device. So to get started, um, once you put it up, you will be presented with the language select. So from here, simply select your language. Uh, I'm going to stick with English and then tap on start. Don't have the ability to insert our SIM card. I'm going to skip this. And next page, Wi-Fi connection. So if you have some kind of Wi-Fi near you that you can connect to, go right ahead and connect. Uh, or if you don't want to or don't have one, you can simply skip it. Uh, the only thing that you will miss out, or miss out on is the ability to log into your Google account throughout the setup, which you can still do after the setup is complete anyway. So I'm going to skip and continue in offline for now. Then we have date and time. So if it's not correct, you can set it up. If it is, uh, then disregard this, which for me, it actually is correct right now. So let's tap on next. Then we have Google services, uh, so we have location scanning and send user and diagnostic data. You can tap on the drop down to read exactly what it does. And if you don't like it, you can disable all of them if you want to, and then go down and accept. And on the next page, we can set up a screen lock. So this is completely optional. If you want to protect your device, you can set it up by default. It goes to a four digit uh, pin, but you can change it to be either password or also pattern. I'm gonna choose a pattern, tap on next, confirm. There we go. So now the pattern is set. And here, your finger, I don't want to add a fingerprint, so I'm gonna skip this. Wireless update, and now we do have to agree to the both of these before we can continue. So accept and continue, and there we and there we go. We're now done with the setup. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.